How's it going my good friend SirTech20 here and welcome to the Call of Duty Black Ops 3 multiplayer beta for the PS4. Now the beta started yesterday, well as far as I know yesterday, and it ends unless Activision and them at Treyarch decide to extend it, it ends on the 26th for PS4. And then it starts for the PC and Xbox One for a week. So. Um, as you can see, I'm level 13. Whoops. Yeah, I'm level 13, so I've been playing it a little bit. Well, by little bit, I mean maybe four and a half hours, possibly. I've only really messed around with one class. Well, class, which they're called specialists in this game. And they have two different abilities that you'll be able to use, or that you can use. And when it shows the yellow circle with the three black lines going through it obviously for black ops 3 the three black bars it's for using unlock tokens to actually unlock the ability and what this is is um it's also on a cooldown so you don't have to rely on kills to get it but it's like your special ability for that class and once it becomes available it'll let you know that such and such skill is available and you activate it with r1 and l1 now the class i was using was this one right here, the Prophet, with the um, glitch special ability? Oh, it's fucking awesome. What it does is when it becomes available, and I'll obviously show it in gameplay a bit later, but what it does is once you press R1 and L1, when it tells you that it's available, if you're by an enemy or something like that, and you know that they've got the drop on you, you can uh, activate glitch, and it'll teleport you back three seconds. Like, wherever you were in the game three seconds ago is where it'll put you back to. So it's like a quick teleport back. But, it doesn't reset everything else in the game, it's just, it resets your position to 3 seconds, or wherever you were 3 seconds ago, so, I think it's pretty neat. I haven't messed with anything but glitch, to be honest, so, I'm gonna go ahead and, ay ay ay. um, yeah, they got a, the, a bow in here called the Sparrow that fires bolts with increasing range the longer it is drawn. Enemies explode on impact. It's got a nasty AOE to it too. So if, even if the arrows don't land on you, if you're around when it explodes, you're pretty much dead. I'm not saying that from experience. No. Okay. Yeah, this thing. Oh God, is it annoying? <laughs> because you might as well not even go around the person that has this ability unless you manage to like snipe them down or some shit for a little bit. Because it's, I don't know if it has unlimited ammo. I've only been on the receiving end of the grenades. I've never actually used it, so. You get kinetic armor, reactive armor that deflects enemy bullets away from the body. Oh, okay. Yeah, the, the level cap in this beta, as far as I know, is level 28. So, you'll be able to unlock Seraph and Nomad at, I swear it's like a crisis reference. You just can't do anything with any thing from here on out so yeah classified specter at level 40 reaper at level 34 okay so let's see here what do i want to do actually i might like that vision pulse yeah then once you hit x on it it'll ask you if you want to unlock it or if you want to unlock and equip it so we will go ahead and unlock and equip it weapons type my target and once you change it or decide which ability you want, it's obviously going to change what specialist you have. Because as you'll notice, that's not the same specialist I had when I started this video. So, you can see that once I, if I go back All to glitch. All systems check out. Ready for deployment. It's this dude. But. First in the fray. Okay. Now, I've already made some classes. The, yeah, that was the very first one I made called testing. How, you know, how creative. Assault and shoot. Come on. Come on, you know. <laughs> I'm so immature. Anyway, the assault and shoot is pretty much just the basic, yeah, the arc seven, which is like an AK-47 type deal. The reflex sight, the quick draw, nothing really special. I do not know I had the grip unlock for you. I'm a dumbass. Then you have the obvious perks, and up there in the, well, I'm pointing to my TV screen, that's real good. But up in the top right corner there, you see where it shows nine out of ten. 
and that's letting you know how many slots you're able to use out of the max amount that you're able to have. So I'm pretty sure that almost anyone that's watching this that would play Call of Duty knows most of what this is. This is just a little bit refined. So let's see here. Equip wild card four. Um, second perk three. Okay. Blast suppressor. Enemy movements are easier to hear. Yeah, you have the maximum number of... Fuck my life. Oh, that's right, because I got three attachments on the gun. Okay, I'm a dumbass. Wait, no. Now let's remove that. Okay, good. I don't want two concussions. Shit! You can't have that available until after level 28. Select... As you can tell, I'm deciding while I'm recording for the first time with this game to actually be a little bit um, away from normal compared to what I usually do because I usually just run the basic grenade and flashbang with the basic perks. Well, it's not really basic, but for this game anyway. Just like the basic stuff to get me started, that way I can get a feel for the game. If you do not have a secondary weapon equipped, you will use fists. Like both your fists, you could... <laughs> have a fist fight with people. Been on a receiving end, never been on the um the scent or the the end that's offering the fist to the face. Wow. Okay, so anyway. This gun's pretty beast. It's just I'm not the best when it comes to aiming with it, but then again, when it comes to shooters on a controller, like uh for consoles usually, I'm not the greatest when it comes to aim. My sweet spot is PC and or the mouse and keyboard for PC. Let's see, I'll go ahead and you know, switch it back to reflex sight. Okay. But yeah, what we're gonna go ahead and do oh boy. Oh I just realized she has the bow on her back too. Oh well, you just have to unlock wait, how many points do I have? I just realized that I have three available. So fuck that I'll unlock Let's this go bitch too. Me up a kill. Nice. I didn't know that. And score streaks, I don't have a lot unlocked. Uh, well, I'm not going to be able to have a lot of these unlocked. Connie UAV, that'd be very nice. But, uh, I got a bit. Wait, actually, yeah, that's like just before maxing out your level cap in the beta. Okay. Actually, I'd rather that be a care package instead of that thing. Okay. And yeah, they, they have to nag you with the whole the feature thing up here. Hey, pre-order the deluxe edition for a hundred bucks. So I'm kind of nervous because I've never played this class before. But I guess that'll kind of oh boy. And as you can see up there where it says online players, the percentage of the amount of people that are online that are actually in this specific playlist. Team Deathmatch, Domination, Demolition, Kill Confirmed, Hardpoint, Capture the Flag, and Search and Destroy. My two favorite modes are Kill Confirmed and Team Deathmatch by far. There's, those are the only two modes I really enjoy. So, we're going to go ahead and try to get into some Team Deathmatch if the servers are nice enough. And another thing before the game actually starts is the fact that once you're in the game and you press the options button on the PS4 controller, it's not going to show you this stuff. Well, yeah, it's not going to show you that. Okay, good. I had that on. It'll show you your ping levels and your packet loss. Just seeing exactly how well connected to the server that you are because this game's supposed to have dedicated servers. Deathmatch. Ready to deploy downwind. Yeah, see, so press and start. It shows you your connection or your ping and your packet loss. Very nice addition. Get kinetic. Oh boy. If I start talking loud, it's because I, um, yeah, the headphones. And with the way this game's audio is. The 
fuck? In case you haven't figured it out already, I'm not exactly MLG Pro with this game, at least not on consoles. And when I say consoles, I really mean just with using the controller. You can jump into the water and swim to the other side if you want, I just don't feel like it. Yo. Scan yeah, I killed one. AIA. <laughs> Hostile UAV above. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Nope. Didn't scare the shit out of me at all. Nope, I'm good. I have to say one thing though. I do like the way that this game looks, even though it's obviously uh, not the highest in, te or in terms of just like texture resolution and shit, but it looks nice. It, the way that the uh, the map design looks, you know, just like the ambient sounds and shit make the maps feel alive. Be advised, hostile lightning strike targeting Be advised, hostile Fucking. lightning strike inbound. Enemy. This is gonna hurt, ain't it? Or not. And to see your, like the scoreboard on PS4, see upward direction on the PS4 controller. Come yeah, on. Annihilator shut down, bitch. The Annihilator is a special ability from one of the. Shit! Oh my god! Fuck! Yeah, you see that bullet that she was shooting? Or, well, that person. You don't have to be a, a woman to use that class, but it's the character was a female. Leave me alone. E K I A. In your face, bitch. Okay, I'm nervous about using the bow because I've never used it before. Wasted. Yep, no shit. I really need like better grippers on this con or this controller. That way I can my fingers won't <laughs> slip off of it. Confirmed. Okay, here we go. Here's the special. See if I don't fucking fail using it. Oh! What? And I got King Slayer. <laughs> fucking. Yes. Yeah, yeah, I probably could have just go ahead and let that go. I'm actually not sure that if you do that, if it cancels the rest of the ability. Wow, I can't even throw a fucking grenade properly. What? This game. down there even without me kill <laughs> even without me killing enemies it's still charging up but just very slow yeah it doesn't rely on kills it just I'm pretty sure that kills help it never been under here before so I don't really know where the fuck this thing's gonna take me oh Okay. Let's 
is rather quiet compared to how this level usually is. UAV inbound. I've seen that. Ha! Ah, finally, I don't go down from a fucking gun. Fuck. Smoke checked. There's no hope for me in this game. Seraph down. Yo, what the? Is that an enemy? Yes, I know. Battle ready. Let's hunt. Yay! Oh shit! <laughs> nice. And another thing, I'm probably gonna have to switch uh this place. I'm using the big fifty or a fifty one or fifty two inch TV. UAV spotted. It'd be so much easier if I was using a twenty four inch monitor. Uh. No! gun is that she's down what be advised hostile UAV oh. incoming. That was, that was a good shot. Bitch. The fuck was that? Yeah. What? Why did my guy try r er, meleeing? Oh, I guess I clicked or pushed down too hard on the R3 button. Oh my god, I, mm. I'd be so much, no, shit. Disadvantages of not being able to, or being able to have all my cooling units and stuff like that on because it'd be so fucking loud it isn't funny. So I get to sit here, sweat my ass up and bitch about it while recording a video. Advised. Hostile care package overhead. What's my wow, 11 and 16? It ain't the worst of them, but it ain't You're the, letting get the down the pack. Fucking bitch. Moth. Counter UAV inbound. Are they just hiding? I don't fucking see anybody. There are no words for what I just saw. That's a hard fail. We kicked our asses. Oh, I see how you do that. You just you have to decide like this which one you want to use. Let's go stock me. I actually want to try out this one. Just go and do some kill confirmed. Hope that the commentary sounds okay with this.
since as you can tell by the my placement in the or the footage for the face cam that I'm obviously positioned differently because I'd be like this if I was recording on the PC. But since the TV's right her, gotta be this way. Really? Come on, game, don't do this to me. Nice full game. Kill confirmed. Time to get kinetic in this AO. Green light. Green light. Prepare for spammy, spammy fun times with people and their fucking grenades. Oh my god, the whole fucking team. Oh, the entire team came the same way I did too. I didn't even really get it. Wasted. God damn it. No fuck. Hostile UAV above. This is gonna be a clinch match, I can just feel that already. Yo, what? Oh wow. It's gonna suck if you're, to come into, if you're gonna come into this game a bit late, and by that I mean like the beta. You're gonna see people that are maxed out and they're gonna fucking own them. UAV incoming. Because of the fact that they got like the better weapons and all the attachments and everything else. They Hostile care package overhead. smoking out. Be advised, hostile lightning strike targeting active. Oh, great. No! Hostile lightning strike inbound. The fuck is that? UAV inbound. HCXD inbound. Okay, I get it. You tell me to go a different way. Tempest recharging. Oh, I walked right past. Be him. advised, hostile UAV. I, yeah, incoming. I need a smaller screen. This thing's a waste of fucking space. Nice. Man, I don't like how slowly you move like when you're, uh, Hostile if you're aiming down the sights, you move so fucking slow. Be advised, hostile care package overhead. Be advised, hostile dart in your AO. Yo, that lag though. Oh shit. Be advised, hostile lightning strike targeting active. Shit. UAV inbound. UAV, ready for Be advised, hostile lightning strike inbound. You don't get off of me now with Wi-Fi.
Wow, dude, my knees can go a fucking grenade farther than that. I should have watched closer to that. Them taunts, though. Neutralized. Nice. Wow, that was. Ah, oh, I can't keep my fucking hands as steady on these sticks because there's like nothing to them. Friendly UAV inbound. You throwing it at? Sure, the hell wasn't the enemy. Profit wasted. Tango down. It's down to this. Pick it up. Be advised, hostile UAV incoming. What? Oh, the stupid no skill required shot. Wasted. What? Can you let me respawn. Thank you. Oh, Terrible god damn it! CDP. Come on home. So many people I didn't sign out? up for this shit. We need to fight smarter. Oh, I have to be the last kill. Never mind, no, it wasn't. He wasn't even in the water, but I guess, yeah, it changed to enemies. I didn't, well, I didn't go positive. Another thing that's really irritating, well, so far at least for me in this beta, granted I'm assuming it happens in all COD games, but it's fucking annoying, is, um... Before, just before the match ends, like, whichever, or some of the people that are on the losing team, they just, like, immediately leave the game. It's kind of annoying, actually. Okay, let me see. I only have two unlocks available, so. Charge shot weapon that fires an arc of electricity. Yeah, that's what I got hit with. Battery reporting for duty. Okay, I'm gonna go ahead and do. Um. Yeah, we'll do another kill confirmed. This is definitely different from what I usually put on my channel, so. I mean, I enjoy Call of Duty. It's just, it's not what it used to be, obviously. Kill but confirmed. 
Black Ops, you're clear to engage. Be advised, hostile UAV incoming. package overhead kills me it's like i start shooting him first but they just out of nowhere are able to just destroy me it's not like i'm well that one i did but it's not like i missed my shots in all my gunfights doing a lot of them don't get me wrong i'm not the greatest when it comes to accuracy with a controller but whoops Hostile Guardian spotted. Fucking Hostile UAV above. Wait, did I kill one of them? I don't think I did. The Guardian sound no. What? Oh, you lucky bastard. Watch kills. No. Be advised, hostile UAV incoming. War machine up. Range dialed in. That was luck. <laughs> yeah. Never used this thing before, so and before I fail horribly. That's what this fucking thing does. <sighs> See what I mean? I'm fucking horrible with aim on the controller. It doesn't help that for people with big hands, you miss one bro. Friendly UAV for people inbound. with big hands and people like with sensitive fingers and shit like that, these dumpsticks don't exactly have a lot of padding on them at all. Yo, hey, yo. And now my fingers are starting to cramp, which is going to piss me off. It's just the fact that I have, Whoa! The fact that I have to hold the controller so tight because of how easy- or how much- Nope. What? Get the fuck out of here. Dedicated servers ain't helping this bitch much. Hellstorm inbound. Nice. Boy, that glitch would have saved my ass right there, but I'm not using that clash right now. Hostile UAV above. UAV inbound. Grabbed him. Nope, oh, you missed one. Oh shit. It's gonna be bad. No! Fuck! Always happens to me. Always. Friendly UAV inbound. Care package inbound. See what I mean? It's like I can never win a fucking gunfight. I don't like half the guns in the game, so that sucks. Down. 
Ready to fire for effect. No. Deployed. UAV inbound. No. Yeah, huh? Fuck you, motherfuckers. Like, this man's that shit. Eyes on enemy. No. Yeah. UAV ready for deployment. Get a UAV Push overhead. It. We now. got this. In the top, sensors are on. Assault airport. unit down. Hellstorm awaiting orders. No! Hellstorm is back. Wait, what the fuck? Hostiles Come on. Destroyed. No! Me. Nope. Really? What fucking button do I push to make it work? TACOM, could use Care a package right. inbound. Got it. UAV inbound. Package delivered. Be advised. Hostile UAV incoming. Start drone ready for deployment. Oh my god. No. This is not what I thought it was. Friendly lightning strike inbound. Okay. All mission objectives met. Prep for evac. What? It's over? Already? Well, my good friends, I had fun with that. You guys love to let me know if you'd like to see more of the beta. Um, I'm debating on if I'm going Well, I'm probably going to do some stuff on PC with it too, just to see the differences in controls, if the servers are any better. Granted, they're likely not going to be, because they're most likely the same servers for all this. Well, you know, dedicated servers for each of them, but... It makes me, it makes me wonder, with Xbox One and PC, the beta for both of those systems coming out the same day, like, if there's going to be any is or major issues with the servers as compared to the way they are now. I mean, you can still have the connection interrupted thing because of the fact that this is beta and it's the first time the servers are being stressed like they are right now. With, you know, hmm, I want to say at least, well, I want to, okay, maybe 300, 400 plus thousand people. It just, I can't see it being less than that. With as many people as I can imagine pre-ordered it for PS4 and with competitive COD switching to PS4 now. So... Imagine a lot of pro players are streaming it and playing the shit out of it too. But with that being said, depending on where you guys live in the world, I hope y'all have a good day or night. Um, obviously, if you like the video, I'd appreciate the thumbs up. Comment below if you guys would like to. If you'd like to see more, let me know. I'll, I'll likely be playing more of it after I'm done recording here. I'd like to see about getting myself up to that level 28 cap. So, yeah. Um, I thank you guys for watching and see you guys in the next video. Peace.